Dimension P90 lovers. In this quarter, 2004 Les Paul Jr. In this corner, 2009 Paul Reed Smith SE1. Let's kick the tires a bit. Okay, the Gibson Les Paul Jr. This is an all mahogany uh, guitar, mahogany body and mahogany neck, rosewood fretboard, single P90 pickup, dot inlays, and you will find vintage style and closed tuners. I believe it's a 24 and 3 quarter inch scale length on the neck. Uh, this particular one it supposedly has a nitro finish, nitro sunburst finish. And there you have it, your Gibson Les Paul Jr. And now to the Paul Reed Smith SE1. This guitar is also all mahogany, mahogany body and neck with a rosewood fretboard, single P90 pickup, just a volume control, no tone control, uh, the new moon type inlays. You will find that it has modern style and closed tuning machines. I believe it's a poly finish on Paul Reed Smith guitars. This one is made in Korea. The Junior is made in the USA. And there you have it, your Paul Reed Smith SE1. <laughs>
man, these are both great guitars. Uh, I like the Paul Reed Smith. It's lighter. It's lighter, easier to hold. Very tight, focused sound. Definitely has that junior growl, a little more focused. Like all Paul Reed Smith guitars, it just plays flawlessly. It actually has a little bit fatter neck than the junior. The junior is a little bit thinner. Um, I like it a lot. Uh, but the junior, fat sound. Every note is just fat. A little bit of rawness around the edges. I mean, that is a rock and roll beast. Uh, it's a little bit heavier. Scale length, I think, is a little shorter. I believe this is 24 and 3 quarters, and this is 25. But man, either one of these, I say, would give you that P90 thing you're looking for. Uh, these are selling new for about $1,600. I don't think Paul's making these anymore, but you can find them on Reverb for like six, dollars $700. So this is a good way to get a P90 Junior style guitar at a low price. Uh, but if you're playing rock and roll, hard rock, that Junior just growls. Either one of them I think is a good deal. So I hope you found this interesting. Thanks for watching. See you later.